Hi everyone, so as you all know, I recently did a review on the Sally Hansen Nail Growth Miracle Serum But I've had a lot of requests from you all um, to show you how to make your own serum at home That doesn't have the thousand ingredients that this does and it works just as well Probably even better for your nails. So let me show you what you need You're going to need some biotin supplements and this is the one I'm using from nature's bounty and this is a 5,000 mcg you can get a 1000 mcg um, it's up to you I like this one because it's a little stronger this is the one that I take on a daily basis one one of these gel capsules it looks like this just a soft gel uh, I take one of these once a day for my nails to help my nails grow and next thing you're going to need is a little scissor like this and I've also included some oils in this video because a lot of you have still been asking me what oils to use for their nails so these are the two oils that I love to use um, jojoba oil which is really really great you can find this at a lot of um, grocery stores and vitamin E oil and I've talked to you about this before usually the higher the international units number is the better it is this one is 40,000 international units and I love vitamin E oil I use it on my face on my hair on my skin it's a great antioxidant it is amazing for everything if you have a cut it helps to heal if you have um, fungus once you've treated it with tea tree oil this will help to heal it really really quick it is absolutely amazing I use vitamin E oil on a daily basis for my nails so what I do is I put some vitamin E oil in one of these oil bottles and I add some jojoba oil the reason is that jojoba oil the molecules on this oil are a lot smaller so when you combine the jojoba oil with the vitamin E oil it will pull the vitamin E oil into your nail better because the molecules on the vitamin E oil are typically larger so they won't penetrate into the nail very well oils don't really penetrate the nail plate um, they act as a barrier so it it makes your skin and nails um, sort of like the way that uh, ducks skin you know like the feathers when they get into the water the water doesn't penetrate so it acts as a barrier all right, back to the serum. So there's two ways that you can do this and this is the way that I like to do it. Um, you can take your little scissor, snip off the end and if you squeeze it, can you see there's some of that serum coming right out. So you can just go ahead and apply it to your nails just like I'm doing on uh, bare or polished nails and rub it into your cuticles and you will get the same effect that you do um, when you're from as where you're using the Sally Hansen nail growth serum and you can do this once a day you don't have to do it twice or anything like that this is strong biotin so one of these little gels capsules will do all 10 nails and you will start to feel your cuticles getting nice and smooth right away that's what I love about biotin it's a great um, moisturizing agent for your skin um, or you can take the capsule and I haven't really used this a lot so once I finish using this I will take my gel capsule and you can just go ahead and squeeze um, the contents into the little jar here Let me show you guys so just snip off the end and then you can go ahead and squeeze the contents in and once um, it's all mixed up in there then you can give it a good shake and you can go ahead and use it and it is exactly the same thing that the Sally Hansen has minus all the other junk that your nails doesn't need um, and then once you're done with that then you can go ahead to your vitamin E oil and apply it to your cuticles and to the underneath of your nails, to the underside, and do that to all 10 nails. And this is how you get your nails to grow long and strong and healthy and beautiful 
and naturally without all those red five and all those other stuff that was in here that your nails does not need now the reason I don't put vitamin E oil into the serum is because the biotin will is a little heavier so it'll tend to just drop to the bottom and then all you have is this murky looking uh, solution so I just keep them separate if you want to um, add biotin just to this and then do the oil separate that's what I recommend but don't mix the two because then the biotin will just sink to the bottom and it'll it won't mix properly with the oil so that's how you make your own serum very simple just some biotin supplements rub, on, rub them on your cuticles and you are good to go beautiful gorgeous soft cuticles every time thanks for watching I'll see you next time bye